uh, big, big upset opportunity Three, for Raymond Gucci, two, who are looking to continue one, their momentum from yesterday's crew battle. Terror starting off on Demon Island, which is picking up the Asgardian light guitars. And Raymond looking to do the same with the Qatar mirror already. And we're starting on Demon Island, no soft platform to assist the landing. These half these half pipes become a lot more scary, very easy to get out of hand if you give a you know a panicked dodge. And where do you see that here from Fuchu? Burning the dodges uh, early, Raymond immediately reacting with a very fast um with recoveries and continuing juggles, which is always cool to see. And gets some big damage and immediately ends the sideline into the uh the SIG, and that's gonna be the first stock. Uh, going to Raymond, somebody that was doing so well yesterday, uh, Guichibu in the guitar matchup, um, in the mirror that is, and uh, Raymond actually being the better of that, but Guichibu already starting off very strong, strong with the cannon, goes for the gravity cancel, side light on the unarmed, avoids the side stick on, on the guitar, and Raymond seems to be contending pretty well so far versus Guichibu, but no extra credit has been built up yet. They're looking to play pretty safe here, but it doesn't matter because Guichibu closes in that distance and finds that big MSIG uh, to call that out. Overall, a very, very good start for uh, Raymond immediately gets stifled by Guichibu, who puts on an exhibition on the left side of the stage, finally is able to grab the wall once again. The recovery comes through and Guichibu has just been all over Raymond. Raymond won the mirror once, but never again as Guichibu has just ran away with the damage lead here. About 100 damage over this over Raymond. Put your light on the unarmed. Guichibu going for the big haymaker on the unarmed. Can't find it. Next to Raymond now switching over to the spear. Looking to create some space. But Guichibu not looking to give any. Nice weapon toss to get some space on the landing. Goes for another one, but the neutral sig comes through once again from Guichibu. The success rate on the neutral sigs is something that is going to be a big problem for Raymond. A, um, a character like Queen Nai um, with the guitars and with the spear has the ability to burst in and also create range. But sometimes when you get uh, too antsy on the ground, you're not quite finding the success you're looking for. You start result, um, resorting to jumping a lot, and that neutral sig is going to be very, very good at covering with so much uh, KO potential. Guichibu now has a two stock to one lead, the first time Guichibu having a stock lead in this set. To the cannon, down air, gets a big open up on the side, like it's a double side light, but no conversion. Raymond saving the dodge, goes for a run up side sig, doesn't find it, or that might have been a down sig. Nice, Guichibu still finding a recovery, Raymond with a down sig on the spear, tries to catch a dash or some sort of forward progress from Guichibu, can't find it. Reacting with the unarmed, pretty... Pretty well as well as Guichi, but throwing the weapon to get some safety and then finding some space built with it. And that gravity cancel side stick is going to catch the dash wins. in from Raymond and Guichibu taking game number one. Three, two, hello. Right back to Demon Island. The player's not looking to find a, not not looking to change the scenery too much. Just uh, going right back. Raymond with the weapon advantage, very similar to game number one, where the weapon advantage went to Raymond and was able to kind of snowball that into the first stock. Guichibu actually contending with the weapon and saying, I can use the unarmed as well as they start off a big open up the half pipe. Not quite enough to turn it around, but still big damage. Big damage, and I, I am back. I am back. Oh, welcome back. I am here. Back. It is working. Everything is going great. Uh, shout out to PJ for being amazing and keeping up some technical difficulties right there. But I am back in this. We had an explosive first round. Yep. Oh my lord, we did. So it's cool to see um, two really, really strong players on the guitars. Guitars in a great spot, I think, is something I've said quite a lot. Uh, and yeah, players like Wichibu and Raymond on the Queen Eye really showing the power of guitars, uh, being good grounded threats, but also having strong anti-air, good air-to-air -air potential. A lot of times they have pretty good SIGs for the good uh, guitar legends. So um, it's always a treat to see. I know some people uh, have some choice words versus or when they're talking about guitars, but I'm a fan of it. I like the big edge guard sequences. And so far, Guichibu has been fighting the better of it and using the cannon as well in a great way goes for the down air doesn't quite find the weapon toss but does find the unarmed gravity cancel side light to tap in that edge guard Guichibu three socks to one super super dominant really coming into his own in this game number two yes we are seeing that Guichibu is a star player on these Qatars we're getting to watch it time and time again every single tournament that he is in already starting off strong we just saw was it Guichibu yesterday on the Qatars taking a five stock lead in crew battles on his own so i know this player is capable of what they're doing don't see many guitar dittos and it looks like raymond is about to be 
gone off of this map. Glishabu with a delight in there. Not quite taking out. But it, it's last hit for Raymond right now. Yes, that's all you need the dare to take over the corner, and Glishabu is going to be taking game two. Um, crossover, which is still Queen Nye, so we're going to be seeing the same two, weapon set. Uh, Raymond not changing literally anything up besides the skin. Uh, to me, I'm not sure if that's exactly what's called for here. Maybe I wanted to see uh, a different stage or something, but nonetheless, we are here back on Demon Island, uh, which uh, already has uh, Raymond starting off with a big tar open up, but not much more. Uh, as Guichibu, I don't know it's, if it's uh, too biased to say it's only a matter of time before Guichibu catches up, but that's kind of how I've been feeling in this uh, game. I don't, I would not say that's biased because we have the proof in front of us, you know, uh -huh. it's not like we're glazing it with no reason. So there's, there's definitely a, uh, there, there's something that happens every time I watch Guichibu play. You can get them down really early and it's just over, like there's a reverse three on, on your, its way in your direction, you can't avoid it. And Guichibu, especially with these Katars, will tee up. There's no building a great lead on this player. But Raymond does have a chance to pull through and, you know, take down the King of Katars for now. Yeah, I mean, this However, is a they... lot closer than the first game, uh, that's for sure. Yes, that first game was... I, I don't even know. It, it's a sight to behold. It's a hype first game to have in this set. And seeing the double Katars, I did not expect it personally. But I should have known from the legends these players play that this was going to come out. Vichibu now on the cannon, and Raymond is seeming to, to be finding their groove. I hope it's not a little too late, though. Oh, it might be Vichibu with a side sig, taking Raymond's second stock. Now it's 2-1. to one. Vichibu opting for the Katars. Obviously, we know how they play on Katars. Very consistent, very clean. Raymond is going to have a hard time bringing this game back. Yeah, you have so much damage deficit. You're down a stock, and Guichibu just continues to build on this big damage. It's really a death by many cut situation. Guichibu just winning all these neutral interactions, avoiding that end sig attempt from Raymond. Guichibu picking up the cannon now, looking for that neutral sig to close out the set. Doesn't quite find it, and Raymond picks up a weapon. The spear in hand has a big juggle opportunity. Finds the downlight into Ooh. this air. Not quite enough to KO, but a great spot to be in. If you're Raymond, you can now weapon start Guichibu. Goes for the uh, end sig there. Doesn't quite find it. Gravity cancel uh, neutral sig on the unarm is going to come through from Guichibu. Not enough to KO, but Raymond getting a little oh, too, no. too uh, trigger happy with the sigs and Guichibu punishing accordingly. That's going to be Guichibu taking the set in a 3 0 fashion. 3 0 just like that. We saw Raymond really struggling to finish that game off and get a KO on Guichibu's second stock. It's, it's really hard to KO a player who knows exactly what way you're going to play it. And with the way Guichibu reads, I mean, you can't panic signature three times in a row and expect to get away from it. 